Hello. What I bring here today is just a couple of new features for Bridge Creator. The first one, if you go to the tab More, you have this input. And then from any Tecla construction line, you can convert it into Bridge Creator feature line. Select the line, give it a name, and convert. So let's do the same for the left hand side and for the right hand side. Note these lines are 3D polylines. So here the left hand side, convert into a bridge creator feature line. This line is needed for bridge creator then to read and to extrude along that line. The construction line after this is not needed. So we have now three lines and let's delete the three construction lines that we don't need it anymore. As you can see, the line is in a V shape, is on purpose. You can then put this line into a phase that is not used and could be filtered out uh, from the drawing. No one will delete this line by mistake. Then if you jump into the tab Manage, you have here display changes or stations along any line. Select the line and Bridge Creator will display those changes or stations along that line. You'll see the values. Another thing we can do is to convert and to get a setting out point with at any change of the chosen line. So here I type the change or station that I want. I don't want to zoom automatically automatically into that setting out point. Select the, the, the center line, mid mouse click, and you'll have a layout point with information for the change, station, value, and the Z, the level. This can be then used in the drawings with an automatic tag, for instance. Another thing you can do with Bridge Creator now is to, if we have two lines intersecting, even if they are different levels, select the intersection, select the center line, and then you'll have a layout point with information for the change station of the intersection and the Z level. Note this values are the road line values is not the length along the line so the road values are given is the horizontal projection of the line if you redraw during the model you can then always come back and display the changes or stations over again 